You don't mind if I, uh, if I smoke, <laughs> do ya? It's just, you know, these days you gotta be polite and all. I mean, I, I, I am polite. It's just that you didn't used to have to ask, you know? But hey, I got manners just as anyone else. So, uh, you don't mind, do you? It's just that, you know, my nerves have been really short lately. You go through things, you think everything's all right, and then you gotta light. I swear I brought my lighter out of here, but, nah. Here it is. <laughs> you, uh, you probably don't have a light anyways. You know, the way you're dressed. Rana. It's supposed to be real good for you, running. You know, myself, I could just never see it. You know, seems like you only end up right back where you started. Tired. You got kids? I, uh, I got, you know, I don't gotta tell you how uh, raising kids is. I mean, especially these days can be total hell. What are you supposed to do with them? Sit around and play Miss Mary Jane Holy Mother? Well, you what? Wipe the noses? Make sure there's milk in the goddamn refrigerator. You know, these cigarettes these days, huh? Pretty expensive. You know, for some people, it comes down between food and a pack of cigarettes, huh? I never done that. If anyone asks, I'm good at that. Cooking. Meatloaf. Uh, tuna noodle casserole. Fucking uh, cream of mushroom soup. I mean... Excuse me, but God, I hate that stuff. I mean, you ever look at it? I mean, really look at it. Fucking, fucking cat vomit. Fucking something the dog puked up. And I mean, that smell. Whew. I mean, I guess you can put, you know, a can of tuna with those little flat, crunchy noodle things. And, you know, it takes the goddamn smell away. The kid's a kid. He likes it, you know? Toast. Toast. You think I'm fucking kidding? You ever get to the toast to come out the same time as the eggs? You know, the way your man likes it? The old man say says he likes it, says he wants it that way, huh? Last thing you want is a, you know, your man sitting across the table with a lump of butter on his toast, huh? Give you said that look. I tell you, once was enough for me, huh? <sighs> all right, all right. I'm trying to quit. See, rubber band. It means I really want one, huh? So I really want one. Do you mind? You know, Joe, he tried quitting. Came home one day, said, uh, he's quitting. No one was going to tell him he smelled like no goddamn ashtray. I said, who said that? You know? <laughs> he said, uh, what he always says to me. He said, shut up, and it's none of mine. You know? So... I just, anyway, that's what, what started it, you know, quitting like that. It was seeing uh, him smoking, seeing me smoking, wanting to stop, you know, I wouldn't, I couldn't, you know, said I'd go outside, so it didn't matter if I went outside. He didn't want to think of me smoking every time I went outside, every time I touched the doorknob, he gave me that look. So I quit. <laughs> While he was home, at least, you know, still had to take out the garage, you know, grab a quick smoke. That was, uh, that was the problem, of course, you know. That's when uh, Kyle started fussing. You know, you just love it so much, you know, taking in a drag or two, watching it float away. So pretty, you know, but the baby was fussing. I mean, I knew Kevin could take care of it. He knew what the bottle was. He's such a big boy, such a good big brother. You know, maybe if I'd just been a little quicker, maybe. Joe's nerves and all, you know? Like I said, you know, me smoking wasn't doing any good for anyone. I don't think he meant to hit him that hard, you know? He was uh, just trying to get Kevin to feed the baby faster. Corner of the table. It was really my fault, I know. 
You know, it's really nobody's fault. You know, Joe, he didn't know his own strength. So, now. I'll get through this funeral. And me. The baby. And Kai. When we get back from child welfare. We'll figure out a way to go on. Some way, one way or another.